is this a doomsday scenario or nothing to worry about? The asteroid known as 1998 or R2 has gathered quite the attention recently. Many believe that it will hit our planet in April 2020, calling it the killer asteroid. But the question is, will it hit the Earth? The asteroid 1998 or R2 was first discovered in 1998. It is an asteroid which we have been aware of for two decades and NASA has been monitoring it since. This asteroid is relatively large, having a diameter of 2.5 miles. When this celestial object makes its closest approach to Earth, it will be traveling at a speed of 20,000 miles per hour. And when it does, both professionals and amateur astronomers can view it using their telescopes. The asteroid closest approach to us is predicted to happen on 29th of April. It will have a visual magnitude of around 10 or 11, and this means that it can be seen with the naked eye, but rather with at least 6 to 8 inch telescope. But we do not exactly know its shape and size. When this asteroid makes its closest approach to us, it will be a unique advantage for scientists to study it. Will this asteroid hit Earth? NASA list asteroid 1998 or R2 is a potentially hazardous asteroid, but it is not on a direct course towards us. On 29th of April, it will come within 4 million miles to Earth. And any object that come with 0.05 astronomical unit is potentially hazardous. One astronomical unit is the average distance between Earth and the Sun. This is the most prominent asteroid to fly by Earth in 2020. Understandably, it may cause some concerns, but there is no need to worry as chances are very low to hit us. However, there are some things which can alter the asteroid's course and might put it into a direct collision course towards the Earth. But again, chances are very low. According to NASA, the asteroid will not come more than 16 times the distance between us and the moon. NASA didn't issue any warnings about a possible catastrophic collision. Every near-Earth object is a small solar system body whose orbit brings it close to Earth. All these objects are closely monitored nearly every month and dozens of near-Earth asteroids come within 0.0 astronomical unit of Earth. That is the equivalent of roughly 4.6 million miles. As these celestial objects orbit the Sun, some near-Earth objects make a closer approach to Earth. These objects are not necessarily near the Earth, but they can potentially approach the Earth relatively closely, therefore a close approach. Most small asteroids frequently burn up in the atmosphere and thus do little damage. They usually few meters across in the diameter. Some asteroids with a diameter of around 20 meters have created shock waves that shattered windows. The asteroid that hit Siberia in 1908 had a diameter of around 40 meters. Such an asteroid has the potential to destroy a city or even create a tsunami entirely. The larger asteroids hit less often than the smaller ones, but they can cause an environmental destruction. Around 10,000 years or so, asteroids larger than 100 meters are expected to reach Earth and cause local disasters. What will happen if this asteroid hits Earth? As long as the asteroid is classified as potentially hazardous, there will always be a small possibility of an Earth-bound collision on the later and specified date. Based on the current estimate of its size, if the asteroid would hit Earth, it will surely bring significant devastation. Some actually believe that it may wipe the human race. Though this asteroid will not hurt us, some external influences might change the asteroid's trajectory. The gravitational tug of planets over time could cause an object's orbital path to evolve into an Earth-crossing orbit. It opens up the possibility of a future collision. Some scientists believe that the effect of Mars and Jupiter's gravity can actually dislodge some asteroids from the inner asteroid belt and where they think most Earth asteroids come from. However, there is another process by which an asteroid can and change its path. It is caused by the fact that the asteroid is in direct sunlight heating, cools down and releases radiation from its surface. The radiation exerts a force on the asteroid similar to a thrust and this can slowly change an asteroid direction over time. The third scenario implies that an asteroid could be hit by another object breaking into smaller chunks and couldn't them hitting towards Earth. 